on you guys. So today I'm going to be taking a look at my top five picks for tomorrow. I'm going to start making these series every single day to help you guys out to find different opportunities in the market. So make sure you guys subscribe, hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on any of those videos. So the first stock is space. So a lot of news has come out with SPCE Virgin Galactic that they're completely redoing their whole entire design to take people to space and that spaceship that they're talking about. And there's a lot of key things that I'm going to be looking for tomorrow. There's technical indicators that I like within SPCE. We can see on the four hour chart down here, there's a sudden increase in volume as well as the RSI is getting pretty low down here in this area. Those are some critical things that you guys want to look at. When a stock is completely oversold, you can see a strong uptrend to follow or overbought. So as we can see right here, when the stock got overbought right here, it went down overnight about looks about $10, $12 right there. So I'm going to play these options, guys. I know a lot of you guys trade options, so let's take a look at that. The next one I'm going to look at is Apple. So the recent days, Apple has been taking a downturn due to the market conditions. There isn't a whole lot of buying going on, but there's also a lot of opportunities to buy in. So right now, I'm to, I want to take a look at how Apple can react on the RSI. We can see that 118 is a strong resistance point. It hit it back here, and it shot up around $10 or so. So I'm going to look for that level, that strong dip down in the beginning of the market open. I'm going to look for a call option to get into if we see the right opportunity. So take a look at Apple. Uh, you know, futures right now, pretty steady. I hope for a green futures in the morning. And the next stock is going to be the triple Q, QQQ. So the QQQ has been falling quite a bit lately. There's a good opportunity to buy in. I like the opportunity down here on the RSI. See, it got extremely oversold. Right here again, when it got extremely oversold, it pushed back up during that day. So I'm going to watch it after hours today and into the pre-market tomorrow. Those are going to be some critical viewpoints that I'm going to be looking at tomorrow. The next stock I want to take a look at, guys, is Square. Square has done a lot with their Bitcoin purchasing, cryptocurrency currency integration, which is going to be huge for the future. There's a strong trend line. And as you can see right here on the trend line, we did not get that bounce right here, and it broke through the trend line. But there's still opportunity for it to hold this trend line. There's strong resistance around here and some consolidation around here at the 211, 210 standpoint. 210 is a psych level to watch for. So tomorrow I'm going to be looking for, it's currently completely oversold below the lowest RSI indicator. And the MACD is looking like it's about to close. So if we get the crossover on the MACD and it bounces off the RSI, Strong volume, I want to see this push up to around 2.32 in the next coming days. So take a look at Square. And my fifth stock that I'm going to be looking at tomorrow is Boeing. Boeing has gotten a lot of hype in the past few days. We saw this large spike on Wednesday. A lot of people made a lot of money and then that massive dive down. I'm going to look for, see we see this jump right now. And I want to see if it can hold this jump and reach that 230 level again. This area right here has acted as support, 210, 211, once again, psych levels that you guys wanna realize. So we see some consolidation. The MACD looks like it's about to cross over on the four hour chart. Looking at the longer time frame, guys, or the more, the, the length of the time frame as being longer, it can really help you guys out and recognize these opportunities within the market. So. Make sure you guys subscribe because I'm going to be doing these videos every single day. I'm going to try and get them uploaded around 4. That way it's not so late. I apologize for the late upload today. But make sure you guys take a look at these five stocks tomorrow. I'm going to be watching these heavily. Thank you all for watching. Hit that subscribe button and like the video.